Oh, well, hello, friends. Fedorsevich here. Welcome back to some Hearthstone. With my favorite deck, the Raza Shadow Reaper Anduin. This deck has definitely been providing me the, the most stars on ladder, as well as the most fun on ladder. So this is probably the deck that I'm going to be pushing with a little bit if we ever do decide to make our push from rank 10 to 5. And if not, you know what? We'll just keep playing all sorts of funny decks along the way. I think I want a Doomsayer here. Or do we just at least? Let's just at least. Let's just, let's just get out the stronger minions, because honestly, I think that's a better play in the long run. Doomsayer is going to be for, like, if we have to dragon fire potion in a few turns, and we can dragon fire into Doomsayer or something like that. But right now, I think it's better to get our stronger, our, our stronger, higher-powered minions out. We can kind of punch through this one, heal up if we need to. Oh, my. Oh, my. So our opponent's either playing Dragon Priest, which is scary because of this, or even more potentially scary would be the Raza Shadow Reaper and Dragon Priest. Um, oh. Oh, my. That's... That's not expected. Um, and we can't drag... We can't do that to anything. I'm, I'm tempted to Kazakus Doomsayer. Do we want a 10 or do we want a 5? Well, we want a 5. We want to do damage. AoE 5 is not enough against dragons. What do we do? Summon in 5. Yeah, that's nice. And then the question is, do we do this or do we Doomsayer? Do we do both? We can't do both. What's wrong with me? I think that's that's too much of my own board though, right? I think we go face now. Our opponent's going to be able to do some funky stuff. Maybe their 3-3. Three, three. Maybe their Priest of the Feast comes into our Tark Reaper. And then their 5-6 goes into the 5-4. Something funky like that. But we'll probably find out pretty soon if our opponent's playing duplicates. Or if our opponent's playing just the Raza style. Oh, interesting. Very interesting. Um... So we're going to be able to kind of do some things right now, I think. Like we get, so we're just kind of value trading back and forth here. Very interesting. And we heal up ourselves here. So obviously we're very weak to a dragon fire potion. There's no doubt about that, but we'll, we'll, we'll deal with this 4-8 eventually. There's no, you know, we will get there. It's, it's going to take a little bit of time. And to be honest with you, it might come down to like four or five turns from now when we pint size potion into... Cabal Shadow Priest, my favorite combo, I think, in the game. But otherwise, uh-oh, coining, uh-oh, no, no, not Lich King, not Lich King. Oh, free from Amber, potentially a Lich King. Um, which is bad because, you know, Dragonfire doesn't do much there. Um, we could Shadow Reaper really early, right? What's What's the downside to this play? Like, what would we even do instead of this? I think this is kind of cool. Sure, we give up our board. I understand that's a bad thing. But I think being able to ping our opponent down when we're going to be playing a control, like, our, our hero power now actually does something. Whereas our opponents is just like, yeah, I get to heal their face every once in a while. But we're going to be able to kill whatever they play now. Shadow Visions, good for you. Doesn't bother me. Unless it's another, like, free from amber, then don't do that. Then, then, then that's bad. See? Like, already, our hero power is way better. Um, yeah, I think we have to Medivh. It is kind of Medivh. It was kind of you, Medivh to join us right now. So now we're looking for Raza, and then we can win. Um, that's basically the game plan, I think. Um, so that'll be fun. Uh, there's probably a couple dead draws in our deck right now. Like, we don't want to see Northshire Cleric anymore, uh, because we can't really be healing. Um, Radiant Elemental doesn't do too much for us. Um... Until we're able to start, like... See, again, like, this is just, like, just get out of my way. We're going to kill you, and then it doesn't... You won't even bother us. Which is very cool. Um, and we know that it's Priest of the Feast. And I will gladly take that card. Um, do we even need to play Happy... Oh, we'll play Happy Ghoul. Maybe our opponent wants to burn a Dragon Fire Potion on this board, which would be silly for them, but maybe they'll feel pressured and need to do it. Not, like, peer pressure, but you know what I mean. Some other type of pressure. Pressure. Oh. Um. 
<laughs> Remember when I said we were fine? Uh, <laughs> we're not. Uh, three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so how many times do we have to do this? Um, two, four, six, seven, eight. We were born to eliminate. Um, we can do a holy nova, I think. Hit it. Do we want a holy nova now or no? I think we can holy nova because this is this is too much of a threat for us not to. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is two plus another four. Goes down to six, and then that's six on board. And then you know what? We get a five drop out of this as well, right? So I'm okay with this play. If we if we weren't generating a minion, I would feel a lot worse. But here we get to destroy Ysera, like possibly one of the scariest minions for our opponent to have. Um, and we get to destroy it, and we still have a board after that. We use some minions on board, but we're still able to develop another minion. And there we go. So we are doing Raza versus Raza. We got a Raza off a little bit earlier. Maybe that means more value in uh, the long run. Maybe. Uh, but we don't really know. This is, this is going to come down to now Raza coming out. Um, three, seven, nine. Not really going to matter. Uh, so we'll just go ahead and do this. Not going to worry. It's going to come down to the Razas and then who's able to combo better on Goro packs, I think, basically. We've we both played kind of you know well our opponents played some big threats their their Draco P Twilight Drake, we played uh, Medivh already, so we still have Lich King and a free from Amber. Our opponent also did a free from Amber, right? So yeah, we've got a we've had a couple things already come out. Our opponent's way ahead on fatigue, so that's potentially something, but I don't think so, because eventually one of us will draw Raza and win. So oh Pine Size oh no 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 that's not excellent. Well, things are going to be a little bit more awkward for us now. Okay, well, we we're talking about Pine Size coming back and winning things for us. So that's nice. Five. Do we want to burn a Dragon Fire here? Five plus three is eight. Um, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. Um, we could Dragon Fire here and get a little bit more value. We clear opponent's board. Kind of two, and not really two for one because that's actually our minion. So that's actually kind of bad if we have to Dragon Fire. But I like the idea of controlling. Um, we can get three into face here. So that's good. Do a little AoE action for us, please. Hmm. And unfortunately, we didn't get anything really excellent off of that. But now we'll be able to pint size Cabal ourselves something pretty cool, I'm hoping. And this obviously just dies relatively easily. Yeah, that's just... That's just more annoying than anything. Uh, what would we want? Oh, Shadow Visions is a thing. Uh, what would we want as Shadow Visions? I guess we... Oh, never mind. We need to Shadow Visions a pack. Oh, yes. And obviously, two drops stinks, but... Oh, well. Uh, we're going to do this, and we're going to do this. And then we're going to go ahead and try and do that. And... Uh, and I'm expecting, obviously, the Doomsayer to die, but that's totally fine as well, because we just kind of need to empty out our hand as much as we can, while not really, like, while not wasting any of our cards at the same time. So it is definitely good that our opponent... Oh, what is... Dragonfire Potion as well? What's going on? Just letting it go. I'm okay with that. So this goes... Uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine... Wait, six goes down to five... Um, so let's just take a couple. Um, do we want the pings or no? No, because we need to play stuff. So if we get something big, we want to be able to play it. Oh, baby. Golden Legendary. It's a pretty good card, I guess. Um, we'll just play this one, though. Uh, and we will do nothing else. <laughs> and we'll just say go. Because now we got a whole bunch more resources that our opponent's going to have to get through. Like Stegadon, obviously, easy to, you know, not a great minion, but 6 health is just going to be a pain for our opponent to have to deal with. And Razor Petal's kind of cool. Oh, please don't take Raza. I did that the other day in another one of my videos, and it was amazing. It was hilarious. But I don't want that to happen to us. Uh-oh. Ooh, they got it. So whatever it is, it's a good card. <laughs> uh, unfortunately for us. Oh, what's what's that? Oh, Silence. A little silencio. Oh, there we go. How are we doing this? There we go. Oh, to the cabal. Okay, you can disappear. Um, 
You can disappear. Do we want to preserve this? Yeah, I think we do want to preserve our board now. Because now we're able to be applying pressure. Because if our opponent isn't able to clear this board, we've got a lot of small things that we can do here. And just absolutely wipe our opponent out this coming turn. And if things do go control style, well, then you know what? We've got a lot of big minions that we can deal with our opponent as well. So I think we're in a good position. Obviously, things can very, very quickly switch. Our opponent has not played. I think that's that might be lethal. Uh, this is eight. Um, eight. We need nine. Uh, no, we don't have that many procs. Ooh. Um, I, I like the idea of Charge Devil Soar. Charge Devil Soar, Power Word Shield, Pint Size Potion. Um, hmm. Hmm. Do we like that much as much as just pinging this down and, and playing minions? This is two. Four. Uh, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, let's let's do that. Yeah, let's let's behold the. Ooh, let's not mess this up now, though. Let's behold the glory of a new sun. Hey, mind control. That's a game winner. Um, what do we want to do now? Uh, I guess we'll double someone's health. Let's let's uh, double you. Double you. Um, and that's pretty good. And that would have been seven to face? Oh, was that... I really apologize for that. Oh, okay. That was then lethal, right? Like, we had enough small stuff we could have... No, but no, no, no. Some of those were generated by Lyra. Some of those were generated by Lyra, so that's fine. That's still well played as long as this is not a taunt. Oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah, that was still from Lyra, the, the small cost. And if not, you know what? We had to wait an extra, like, eight seconds until we win. So don't get too mad at me, please. Um, that stuff happens. But, you know, if, if you're here and you're hanging out, you'll get to know those things happen. We try not to have them happen, but they do every once in a while. And I do apologize when they do happen. I'll, and if you do point it out, I do appreciate that, actually, when you are pointing out stuff, especially that I miss. Sometimes I acknowledge my misplay. Sometimes I miss them completely. And I, and I love it when people let me know about it. That is going to be it for this video. That was a fun game. I love that game. That's an entire video. That, that game was worth the video unto itself. So thanks for hanging out with me, everyone. We're going to continue playing this deck and a whole bunch more. Maybe we'll try and push the five sooner than later. Maybe not. Who knows? Um, hope you're all still enjoying the expansion. It's been tons of fun for me. I have not seen all the druids that everyone is complaining about, but that's okay. My own personal meta has still been pretty diverse, so I'm loving that. Thanks for hanging out. Keep your stick on the ice. Oh, subscribe, 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 subscribe.